Lauren, I see somebody's coming to give you a present. Oh, what is it, Lauren? What is it? It's a what? It's a poopy? What? Did you bring this for Lauren? You did, I knew you did. <laughs> he got the floppy flops. He got the floppy flops. Eight weeks. How many do you have? Just two. My sister's back there. What? You wanna go see both of them? Let's go! Can Lauren hold him? Yes, yes. Her, her, her. Because you can hold my baby. Yay! What was your name? Ashley. Ashley, let's go see number two. Oh, look at the other little carrier! Oh, another one! I was sorry to worry. I was like, there it is! Hi! Are they you? Hi! Hi, selling them. Hi buddy! You guys are twins! Oh, look at your little tiny teeth! You want me to buy you one? I'll buy you one right now. No, I can't. You want one? I can't. You sure? Oh my god. I'll do it. Okay, bye guys. Bye, my little little buttercups. Oh, goodbye now. Done? Yeah. Are you sure? What about the formal one? What? What about the formal one? No, I want you to see that one. It's a surprise. It's a surprise? I don't know if I trust you. <sighs> There's something we need to talk about. I feel like I've been selfish. Aaron and I travel all the time, or we're at meetings, or we're busy, or we're away from the apartment for long periods of time. That means that we don't get to give the attention they deserve to our chinchillas, Bun Bun and Chi Chi. Because of that, we don't get to get them out of their cage as often as we want to. We get them out all the time when we're here. But when we're not here, there's nothing we can do about it. We have friends come over, and feed them and give them water, but what kind of life is that? We'll be gone for weeks at a time in the Philippines or in London or in North Carolina visiting our family and you can't travel with chinchillas. So what are we gonna do, put them under the plane? It's, it's, it's just, because we're so busy, they're not living the best life they can live. <sighs> so we interviewed a bunch of people to take Bun Bun and Chi Chi. We checked their background, their history, and we looked for who really wanted to love these chinchillas and care for them for the rest of their lives and give them a good, happy life. And we narrowed it down to one person. Her name is Melissa. She is a first grade teacher and she doesn't live far from here. Not only will she love and care for our Bun Bun and Chi Chi. They will get a new sister and they will get to meet all the kids from her class. And she said we could come with her to introduce Bun Bun and Chi Chi to the entire first grade class. That's gonna be amazing and I can't wait to bring you guys along. She should be here any second. This is the new cage for Bun Bun. She has a full six levels and then here's Chi Chi. Chi Chi's so cute. You're gonna have a good life. You're gonna get to play with so many kids. You're gonna have a new brother or sister. Chi Chi is so cute. She is the best chinchilla in the world. And I love you, I love you, Chi Chi. Bun Bun, you are really cool too. And I'm gonna pet you under you, under your chin. Oh, Chi Chi, we're gonna come visit you. We're gonna introduce you to a new people. The person that's gonna take care of you guys is a teacher and she already has a chinchilla. So she's gonna love you guys. You're gonna have a new sibling and you get to play with the kids. It's gonna be so fun. You're gonna make no, so many more new friends. Yay! Yay! <laughs> Chi Chi, I would like you to meet Melissa. Hi. Hi. You have a chinchilla? I do. She looks just like her. So they have three sisters now. And then you're a teacher? I am. First For grade. First grade? Are you gonna bring them to meet all their new friends? Oh, yeah. And my kids love them, they don't get to see a lot of pets. So she's gonna have a good life and a new sister! Yay! Do you think that we'll be able to come with you to introduce them to the class? Sure. You think? Yeah, school doesn't start until August, but sure. Okay, <laughs> and then we're gonna do it. I would love to do that, that'd be awesome. Oh, bun bun! <laughs> ah! 
Ah, this is it. They're gonna live a good life. They're gonna have so much love and attention that we couldn't give them because we're traveling. And, ah, this is nerve wracking. <laughs> I'll send you pictures. You send us pictures? She's gonna send yeah. us pictures, yes. We were never able to get them to bond, but with more attention than we can give her because of all the traveling, she'll probably be able to get them to bond, and we're gonna see pictures. They're all gonna love each other. It's gonna be one big happy family, and then we're gonna come and visit the kids and bring them to the school. It's gonna be great. All right, you're all set. Bye, girls. Bye, 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 bye. Have fun. Don't let them chew up your car. She can yeah. reach through. <laughs> bye, Gigi. <laughs> Thank, Thank you, you so much. You. It's a new chapter of their lives, and it's gonna be a happy one. You guys do not understand what we just went through. First of all, the bachelorette got canceled. Second of all, the bachelorette got canceled. We got a new TV, and we were trying to get it mounted up there, but the maintenance guys couldn't put it up, so we spent an hour trying to figure that out, but we were working on it for two hours, and the second half is almost done, so we missed the first half. <laughs> But it's okay, because we got the second half playing. And I'm just glad that the Warriors are up, because if the Cavs win the series, I gotta get a tattoo on my butt. They're down by 14. I'm not gonna lie, I'm not confident. And they're not playing at home, and I'm not getting no tattoo. Point. We just got a point. 12. 12, 12 points every half. Okay, 12 point go. game. Still nah. Point game. Food is ready. Welcome to the first, why are you trying to get out of the camera? I'm not. There yeah, you are, you're trying. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to the first ever friends dinner, Della Josh. Thank you, Josh. Thank you. Nice. Bon appetit. I want you to listen. Listen to this guy. His. It might seem a little <laughs> presumptuous for me to have further critiques, but I'm gonna go ahead with them anyway. <laughs> the chicken is pretty good. <laughs> this is Kyle. Kai Yule, and he's reviewing a sandwich yeah, on right. you now, right now. Moist. No. <laughs> This chicken's moist. <laughs> Mia. That was a direct hit at me. A direct shot. How often does he do this? Almost like every day. Everyone said you to the word moist. You guys only don't like that word because you saw someone else say that they didn't like it. <laughs> no one likes the word moist. <laughs> That's so true. Yes. Yes. Nobody's getting a butt tattoo this year. I'm sure we'll find something else that we can we can wager. Okay. You just start thinking. Think hard. Start now. Okay, not that hard. Not that hard. Not that hard. Welcome to the end of vlog talk. What are you doing in the sun? You trying to get your tan on for summer? For the lady pugs? Yeah, you are. Yeah, you are. Um, I'm not a lady pug. In case you didn't know. Hope you guys enjoyed today's vlog, and I'm happy that Bun Bun and Chi Chi are gonna live a better life than what we could give them. Melissa told us that she will definitely be able to get them to bond. It just takes a lot of attention and a lot of time. And by the time we see them again, when we go to introduce them to the first grade class, they will be best friends. Finally! We tried to get them to bond for so long and it wasn't working, but she sounded very confident that she gonna make it happen. Tomorrow, I'm going to my old apartment to get the last few little things I left there, and we're all gonna go down memory lane of my favorite videos that we ever shot in that apartment for the year we lived there. So make sure to come back, hit the subscribe button, also hit the like button, and if you got time, hit that notification bell. And don't forget to remember, if you're not smiling, you're doing it wrong. Okay, bye. Always an elbow or a knee on my side. I, I just wanna